So, <clears throat> if you're like me, Metal Gear Solid 3 was one of your favorite games and how you got into guns in general. Now, after I started getting into guns and I learned how they worked and I used them and became proficient with how they operated, I went back and played the game and something that didn't make sense was how Ocelot's gun jammed. Now, in the game, Snake says, oh, you ejected the first round by hand. And he said, you're trying a technique you've only heard about in battle, this fool should do whatever. What he was referring to was actually just a translation problem. What he was referring to was Ocelot was doing a Middle Eastern technique where you're basically, you're, you will never have a, you see in movies and they're, they're shooting and the person runs that bolt and you hear a click. It was to avoid having to deal with that ever. And basically, if you have full magazine and I shoot all the rounds of this magazine and say that there's one left in there. I drop the empty magazine, I grab another full one, and I put it in, and I just start shooting, and it'll it'll keep shooting with no issues. And you won't have to rack the slide or do anything awkward like that. You won't you won't ever deal with a click, basically. <clears throat> and Snake, when Snake said, oh, you ejected the first round by hand, what they should have said was, oh, you racked the slide after you load the magazine. So as opposed to having, well, usually when you fire semi-automatic, when the last bullet comes out, the slide locks back. And you put a new magazine, you press the slide release, and it goes back forward, you start shooting. But with what also the way he was doing it is that wasn't necessary. He didn't need to do that. He would just shoot, 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 shoot. There's one or two bullets left, switch the magazine, put it back in, and keep shooting for, you don't have to worry about that. Now, what, first what I thought he did was, he had a round in the chamber, and he locked it back, but his hand blocked it from ejecting, from the round from ejecting, so when he closed the slide again, it, we pressed the slide release, you see him like towards he turns and his hand like locks up like this like he was expecting it to do something like he's trying to lock the slide forward and it didn't work but what i think he actually did because it showed him doing it pretty quickly when he, when he turns he turns and then he does this the problem is when you like it like this it gets stuck and that's why he got stuck and that's when snake took advantage and blocked it the problem with that technique Let's see, what I thought originally was he did that, but his hand blocked the bullet from coming out. So it was like that. And then when he locked the side of the release, that bullet just got stuck like that. But either one of those makes sense as to how he did it. So like right now, it's empty chamber. If there was a bullet still in here, if he blocked it from popping out like he was, like you should, like you should, he, he did it. Because you see, he does it like this, which. It works, but it's also dangerous because you can't, if your hand's big, or because you're wearing big gloves like Office Slot was, your hand can block it from the round from coming out. But if you have an empty gun, you don't have to worry about that. You don't have to worry about there being a problem because you just pull it back and let go. And it won't be anything popping out in the first place. But since Office Slot tried to do something that he heard about, he just got a gun jammed. Right now, that bullet's stuck in there, and that's why he lost. So yeah, overall... Translation error. There we go. And basically, yeah, that's it.